G'day, it's Doug from Doug Houston YouTube here, and we're here to help you with tech for content creation. And for you YouTube beginners, this is the second video in the series on how to start a YouTube channel and get going with it. In the previous video, which you can check in the card right here, we talked about how to set up your Google account and create the channel. Today, we're gonna to look at activating the custom channel layout and verifying your channel and some of the back-end stuff that we'll get started on, but continue in the next video. So let's head on over right now and check that out. We're back again, and from where the last video left off, we got up to this point in creating a new channel, and today we're gonna to look at some more of the customization options, which involves verifying your channel. I'm already logged into my brand new channel here. You can see my profile pictures here. It's a DHYT test channel. Again, over here, this little profile pic hasn't updated yet, but that's okay. We're going to click Customize Channel. And what you'll see is it takes us to the old school YouTube layout. And this is where we can do things like add a channel art, add a channel description, and do all those sorts of things. And now when we get to the point where we're going to upload videos, when you initially start a channel, there's a limitation on what you can actually upload in regards to the length, in regards to thumbnails and different things like that. So if you want to add custom thumbnails, which is a pretty basic feature, but an important one, then you're going to want to make sure that your channel is verified. You can see over here there's a cog. I'm going to click on this cog. And this is where we set some of the options for our channel settings in regards to keeping your liked videos private, which I advise leave on. Keep your subscriptions private. That means that people can't see who you subscribe to keep my saved playlist private that's an interesting one as well that's a more complex thing to look at uh, customize layout of your channel is turned on that's what you want to have turned on so at the moment i'm not going to change any of these settings because we're going to come back and look at those at a later time and there's more advanced settings and account access options that we're going to go back and look at later jump out of there now we can add some sort of channel art here uh, I don't have any channel art ready to set up, so I'm going to go into the description. And usually when you write a description, you want to write something uh, that tells people what the channel's about in the first sentence, maybe the first paragraph. Anything after that is more just extra information and fluff. But you want to put something in because when people hover over your uh, profile pic as it shows up in other parts of YouTube, it usually pops up a little card that shows the first... Uh, portion of your description I think it's the first 160 odd characters uh, don't quote me on the exact number so we're going to write something here right now just to invoke the fact that this is a test channel so I'm just going to keep it to two sentences or one paragraph here uh, just for the purpose of this tutorial I can come back and flesh that out a little bit more later so I'm going to click done there now at, the, at this point, it hasn't asked me to verify channels, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Video Manager. You want to go Classic, so that's why I want to jump over here. Now you can see when you first come in, a lot of this stuff is not set up properly, so what you want to do is get yourself over to the uh, Classic Studio. So if you end up in the new YouTube Studio or Studio Beta, then go to Advanced and it will bring you back to the old one. You want to set your country to the correct country that you're in. Just know that in doing this, you are not gaming the system by putting a country like the US or anything like that. So you, if you're a lie about where you are, then YouTube will find you out. You see channel recommendations says allow my channel to appear in other channels recommendations. You probably want that on because that's a good promotional thing. You want your channel recommended so people come and give you views. Uh, subscribe accounts. Display the number of people subscribed to my channel. I advise you to leave that on because... Uh, hiding a uh, subscriber count, no matter if you're small or large, just says you've got something to hide. The reason why you might actually hide it is if, if you've got a, a strictly business branded channel where the number of subscribers really isn't a concern. I'm just going to click save because I updated the country. I'm going to let that save. We're going to look at some of these other settings under channel. This is the important part. What we want to look at is st status and features. Now, this is a roundabout way, but we're getting to the features that we need to uh, get enabled. So at the moment, this brand new channel has not yet been verified. So the whole point of this video is to get this verified. You can see the little check that says we need to verify here. But I'm just, before we do that, I'm just gonna show you all the things that you can earn 
or get enabled uh, some are immediate and some are in the future um, you can upload at the moment from from scratch and you can also uh, unlist and private videos from scratch of course you cannot be monetized from scratch you can live stream but you need to enable it you're ineligible to embed live streams you're eligible to but you need to enable longer videos longer than 15 minutes custom thumbnails are not not enabled external annotations are not enabled super chat is linked in with monetization so you're ineligible for that your custom url you need to reach 100 subscribers for that so you're not eligible yet content id appeals ineligible and channel memberships ineligible so far some of these things come at a later date some of these things are going to get unlocked right now by us doing this we're going to go up and click verify this is how you verify your channel the whole point of this video here we go let's click verify and see what happens account verification step one of two verifying your account by phone that you unlock additional features it helps us to know that this account is a real youtuber and not a robot this is important Select your country, Australia. How should we deliver the verification code? They can call you with automated message or text you. I'm going to have be texted. Thank you very much. And it wants my mobile number. I'm just going to key that in. And here we go. And I have a six digit verification code on my phone already. I'm going to key that in right now. Congratulations. Your YouTube account has now been verified. It's as simple as that to verify your channel. And that is how it's done. Your channel is now verified. Now, what does that get you? Let's have a look. As you can see, instantly by doing that, we've unlocked custom thumbnails uh, and external annotations, as you can see here. We're ineligible for a certain amount of things. There's two things up here. Oh, longer videos is unlocked as well. But there's two things here that's eligible, but we need to enable live streaming and monetization. Let's enable live streaming, first of all. Simply all we have to do is click the button that says enable. And it says, congratulations, you have been enabled. So what I'm going to do now is jump straight back to that channel page. You can see now live streaming is enabled. We've got a green there. Super chat, as I mentioned before, you can't get that until you're monetized. So that one's linked with that. Custom URL, get that when you get 100 subscribers. Okay, when you go to the channel, now you can see because we've verified the channel, we now have a homepage. We have a video page, we have a playlist page, a channels page, a discussion page, and an about page. And you can see at the moment we don't have a banner, so we can potentially put that banner in. And this at the moment says this channel doesn't have any content, so we need to uh, upload content, add a banner, and they're all uh, future tutorials. But that's basically how you do it on a desktop computer, and I advise that's the best place to do it. And by the way, you can't do it on a mobile device in the YouTube Studio app. You cannot verify a channel that way. You need access to your channel via a desktop browser. So if you have a, say, an iPad or something where you have a browser that will mimic the desktop layout instead of a mobile layout, then you can also use that. But I advise you just borrowing someone's computer, logging in, getting it set up, and if you're not going to use that computer ever again, make sure you log out of your YouTube account so nobody else can access it from that computer ever again. Once, once you're verified, then you're good to go on some of the other features. And uh, you're at the point where you can upload videos with custom thumbnails and more. And as I mentioned in the video, once you've verified your channel, you get all those extra features unlocked like custom thumbnails, longer videos on YouTube, and all that sort of thing. We're gonna go into more detail on some of those features in future videos. But for now, make sure to subscribe and check the bell if you haven't done so already, because that way you won't miss out on the rest of this series. And if you wanna check out the entire series, once it's finished, there's gonna be a playlist in the card right now and also in the description below. Well, this is Doug from Doug Houston YouTube, and I'll catch you later.